Oh yes, summer's here. And you know what that means. It's time for your dad to stop beating you and cut the grass. And but before we start this video, we're gonna have an advertisement. My sponsor today is, uh, uh, ShamWow. Just look at how much this thing sucks. Okay, look, we're gonna do this in real time. Holy baloney, now that is a towel you should pay $20 for. It's a fine piece of German engineering. Truly, the Germans can do nothing wrong. Hey, you know what's fun? Video games. You know what's not fun? Uh, mowing the goddamn lawn. But it just seems like people keep making lawn mowing games. I don't know why, but they do. Who could find this fun? I mean, I guess this guy does. Having a good time there, Grandpa? Drinking a goddamn Coors Light? What you should be drinking is LMP, the drink that's world famous in New Zealand. It's a pretty big deal over there. I mean, they built a giant fucking bottle, and apparently this is a big tourist attraction. Sugar-free, sweet as Ellen P. World famous in New Zealand since quite recently. No wonder New Zealand ain't on the map. First up, we got Lawnmower on NES. Now the first thing that you'll notice is that this game was made in 2011. That's incredible that the NES still keeps getting games. Hey, do you know what also came out in 2011? Oh, you know, just a, a little game called Skyrim? Happy birthday, little Dovakin! Yeah, but enough about actual video games. We got some chores to do. Ah, my mom's gonna be so proud once she gets out of the asylum. Woo, look at that lawnmower go! It's awful sprightly, despite the fact no one's pushing it. Ah, shit! I'm out of gas. I mean, I'm sure we've all been there. You start your lawnmower with a full tank of gas, and not 10 seconds later, it dies. Just like Grandma. Luckily, the only thing you need to do to get more fuel is to run over these randomly appearing gas cans. Looks like someone's been playing Ghostbusters! And another thing, don't fuck with these flowers. They'll knock down your fuel supply instantly. Have you ever seen such a deadly flower in a game? Alright, who did that in? Get, get that off screen right now! After mowing 10 lawns, you finish and the game says well done. I'm not too sure about that. I like my steaks medium rare, thank you very much. And now I'd like to shift focus to the PC. The platform of choice for the lawn mowing enthusiast. And of course that means I'm going to talk about Putt-Putt Joins the Parade. God damn it! Hi, I'm Putt-Putt. Come join me on my adventure. So this game opens with like, the smiling ass sun. I'm not sure I trust this guy too much. He looks like he's hiding some murders or something. Good morning, Cartel! Today is the Cartel Pet Parade. That sounds great. I wish I had a pet. Maybe I'll go downtown and talk to Smokey. You know, I think I should get a pet too. What do you think, Jack? I think you should take a long walk off a short bridge. So this is basically a point-and-click adventure for kids. It comes with a lot of interactivity with the environment. That, that's a reasonable thing to happen. That's inappropriate. So you might be wondering how exactly this is a lawn mowing game. Well, it's quite simple. You'll need to earn some money. But how? You could mow some lawns. But I don't have a lawn mower. Here, borrow mine. Yeah, this game has an exciting lawn mowing segment. I like that he has to pull the lawn mower behind him. It's almost as if it wasn't designed for cars to use. The controls for this are a bit awkward. 
You gotta click where you want to go with the mouse instead of using the keyboard. I mean, I know this is a point and click game, but come on. It seems like you're never lined up correctly to cut all the grass in one nice grid. You always gotta go back to a strip of grass that you missed. So this is where I left my magnet. Uh, no, Putt Putt, that's called stealing. I mean, it's like going to a jewelry store and being like, Oh, that's where I left my diamond ring. Thank you kindly. Now, how about putting another coin in the slot, cowpoke? Why is the coin slot a cowboy? That's too, buckaroo. So, long story short, we find a dog in a cave to adopt so we can be in the parade. I wish I had a dog. Uh, I think I can help you with that. Holy crap, it's Brian Griffin from The Peter Show. I thought you died. W what are you talking about? Oh, well, uh, never mind. Uh, what are you doing in my house? Well, I'm here to sing a song about weed and then impregnate Stewie. Uh, excuse me, what? Anyway, Putt-Putt leads the parade. And look, Jack, a bird. Stop trying to appeal to the avian demographic. Next up is the lawnmower game Quadrilogy. Because I guess cutting grass is just such a rich mechanic to milk. Wow, you can already tell this is going to be a great experience. Yep, this is about what I was expecting. I think this is the perfect boomer simulator. Yep. Yep. Oh, that's what beer tastes like? Lawnmower Game 2 is kind of like a racing game. Except I'm just playing by myself. I do like the look of the guy in this game. I always wanted to play as a statue. I also love games where you just go through rings. I mean, it worked for Superman 64, didn't it? And then we have Lawnmower Game 3, which is a horror game. Oh, I'm excited. Um, excuse me, what the fuck is that? Look out, Five Nights at Freddy's. You got some competition. Anyway, let's finish things off with Lawnmower Game 4, The Final Cut. I think this game is fucking broken. But at least this time he plays a sexy, uh, old lady. Finally, a lawnmowing game for the G-MILF enthusiast. I mean, would you rather look at a statue or a sexy grandma? Honestly, I'd rather look at the statue, frankly. Now, there's one last game I would have talked about, but I held off on buying it. It's called Lawmower, where your goal is to cut every piece of grass in the entire world. I watched the trailer and saw you had to run over dogs. You know, I can take many things in life, but I draw the line at running over dogs. What do you think, Brian? Yeah, obviously I'd be against that. What I would really like to talk about right now is atheism. I know Jesus stayed at my house once, but I would like to talk about how God isn't real. Brian, look out! What? No, Brian! I'm alright though. Go to YouTube.com right now to see more Cadbrad originals. If you could call any of this original.